walking is the natural human locomotion, but race walking differs substantially from the natural walk astride, both in the geometry of motion and the dynamics of execution. The present technique of walking facilitates achieving high speed. The winner of the 20 kilometers, Visa, had an average speed of 4 meters per second, and the winner of the 50 kilometers, Lopard, achieved as much as 3.6 meters per second. In other words, the critical speed of walking when even an athlete with a perfect technique loses contact with the ground is approximately 4.4 meters per second. The training rate of the world's best long distance walkers has made it possible to reach speeds approaching 90% of the critical value. With the extreme speeds of competitive walking, the double support moment lasts only a few milliseconds. In this case, the judge may often be unable objectively to decide whether or not the walker still maintains contact with the ground. An analysis of film shots made at frequencies of up to 200 frames per second has shown that a number of athletes did in fact violate the rule on unbroken contact with the ground. Unless this valuable athletic event is to be discredited, the rules ought to be reconsidered. They might, for instance, require only a heel contact with the ground and keeping the extension of the knee joint of the support leg for the entire landing phase, that is, from contact till the vertical movement. This could be checked very well by any judge at any distance with a naked eye. The finish of the 50 km race. The winner, Lopard, Spain, in 3 hours, 53 minutes, 29.9 seconds.